Hello students. Good morning. How are you all? I hope everyone is fine, right? Eh? So, today is 25th of June. Alright. And which lesson plan we are going to study today? Do you know? Let's see. This is the teaching video of social studies block 7 lesson plan 2 right so we have studied lesson plan 1 yesterday and today we are going to study about lesson plan 2 work people do keep ready your resources such as your exceed content book your workbook volume 1 and your notebook pencil and eraser right so before um, we i move further in class i would like just recall the previous learning yesterday what we have learned right so yesterday we could see about the different type of jobs right different occupation such as cobbler so and his work is he mends shoes or he repairs shoes tailors stitches cloth electrician who fixes wires and solve all the electrical problem carpenter who makes wooden things such as table chair beds all the furniture right and teachers who teaches us teaches the students plumber plumber's work is he fixes the taps and all and uh, uh, water pipes doctors right doctors treat the sick people and ill people right so these are the occupation we could see yesterday now Today we are going to see the uh, different things in lesson plan 2. Let's see what is today. Uh, before we see that, uh, just remember these are the keywords. You will be find these keywords in this lesson, right? Tools, training and skill. Tool, tools means a piece of equipment such as hammer, screwdriver, etc. That are used to do particular job or work, right? Training means teaching someone to do something right and skill skill means to be able to to be able to do something well that is called as skill so these are the few keywords you should keep it in your mind when you find it in the further lesson plan next oh there's a question here let me ask you this question what all do we need to write and how did you learn to read and write? I'll repeat. What all do we need to write? And how did you learn to read and write? Let me explain you. We use pencils, pen, eraser, sharpener, chalk, duster, blackboard, pa paper. So these are the things that we need to write. And these are the tools which help us to write tools are so what are the tools tools such as pen and chalk etc so need to write and learn how did you learn to read and write right so tools are things which we need to do a job and we next is we learn to read and write in school how did we learn to write read and write so we learn to read and write in a school at times we also learn to read and write at home from our parents learning to do something is called training understood so today we will learn Today we will learn about something the tools training need for different jobs. 
today so please uh, make this table in your notebook right so job tools and training I'll show you some pictures hmm? list so please write uh, note down this tables and you have to make a pair right I'll show you some list so open your books right open your books before you open just look at this so these are the jobs few jobs are there just look at it what you have to do is just look at this jobs cobbler doctor and tailors right so in the jobs here you have to uh, write the jobs what kind of jobs are there in your books you have to find on page number uh, page number 40 in your book page number 40 right there are few jobs are given there just write down those jobs and what are the tools used in those jobs and where does we where do the people get trained or where they get training right these things you have to list out so your time starts now you can make a pair I, I can do either you can do with the pair or you can do alone okay so you have to look at the list which are given on the uh, page number 40 right write at least four jobs and the tools which are used in that and the training where they get so your time starts now I hope you have done it I have done for you something here the few jobs I have mentioned here cobbler doctor tailor electrician and teachers so for cobbler the tools that we need people need needle glue leather etc and for doctors uh, no cobbler gets training from another person there is a no particular school to train them so it is a skill and it learned from the another person doctor doctors use the tools such as stethoscope syringe and there are many other things etc right and it gets training in medical college doctor gets training in the medical college right next is tailor uh, trailer uses the scissors uh, as a tools, sewing machine, needles, etc. And tailor gets training from training center or it learned from others. Electrician. Electrician use the tools such as tester, screwdriver, etc. And it gets training from technical college understand teachers teacher use pen paper chalk board etc and it gets training from the college so these are the things you have to do it I hope you have done it now this is our aim today's aim so you will be able to recognize the tools and training needed for some jobs okay what are the tools we use and wh where do we get the training for the particular job so let's move we are on the block 7 lesson plan 2 our topic is tools and training this is our topic for today this is the time for the activity now as I told you uh, activities you have already done now let me ask the question from them which tools do you think are needed for this job job which we are listed and where can you get trained for this work right so the answer is already here so these are the for the occupation training gets from the another person like cobbler so we get a cobbler gets training from another person the tools as tools they use needle glue and leather doctors they get training from medical college and the tools which they use uh, is stethoscope syringe teacher 
from college teacher gets training from college and it use the pen paper and chalk carpenters carpenter gets training from another persons and it use the tools such as saw hammer nails so i hope you have understood did you choose correct tools what about the training and which tools are needed for uh three jobs which tools are needed for it is not three job it is a this job right so next question is in which of these job do we need to get trained in college and in which do we don't have to go to a college right so uh correct tools and about trainings and all i have just here listed the jobs right these are the occupation and jobs carpenter doctor electrician weaver tailor pep potter architect teacher chef cobbler these are the jobs right and for the correct tools we use for this jobs are here it is written in front of that carpenter use saws to cut wood screws hammer and nails to join pieces of wood together right these are the thing that carpenter need like the carpenter doctors and uh, the same like carpenter doctor also use the stethoscope to listen the heartbeat syringe to give injection knife and scissor for operation right so so all the tools are mentioned in front of the particular occupations and what do do uh, what about the trainings and all right the trainings are given here carpenter gets training from other person right it is a skill which are passed from one person to another hmm? and doctor gets training from medical college so all the list are given here you can read it hmm? i am not going to read fully you have to read it from your book right next question is uh, in which of these jobs do we need to get trained in the in college and which in which do we need do we don't have to go to college where do we learn them from right so the answer is by listing out so already it is listed out here by listing out from the relevant chapter so from the books i have listed out here and eh? and there are few jobs such as like doctors teacher architect engineer they are trained in college right and whereas potters carpenters tailors cobblers mostly learn the skill to do this work from another person right so or it can it pass through the generation also if the father is doing maybe one of the son or all the son they may also do the same job right but mostly they get another from another person and they learn this skill right next is um, either in the family they get the train either they get uh, they learn from their family member or from the outside also for some jobs we need to study for many years and pass an exam and for some others we don't so you got the idea i hope like uh, the job like uh, teachers doctors architect engineer so they get training and they get ad- they get admission in college so for that they have to study many years and they have to pass an exams then only they become doctors teacher architects engineer etc but some of the some things like carpenter tailors cobblers mostly so they learn the skill from other person they need not to go to any particular college or they need not to write any exam for that right i hope you have understood next question already i have written here doctors teacher architects engineers are trained in college whereas potter carpenter tailor cobbler most learn 
mostly learn the skills to do this work from another person either in their family or outside the family members and for some jobs we need to study for many years pass and pass an exam it should be an not an exam and for some others we don't so please correct it here pass an exam not an exam next look at these pictures these are some tools which are used particular occupation like um, here is a loom loom is mainly used by weavers who use it it is used by weavers and this pliers pliers is used by electrician and this is cutter wire cutter it is used by electrician only and this is saws saws is mainly used to cut woods right this is a screwdriver screwdriver is used by uh, either electrician to just open something and this is the scissor scissor is used by tailors to cut the cloths this is the stethoscope which is used by doctors to listen the heartbeat of the person and this is sewing machine which is used by tailor to make cloths this is a tester tester is mainly used by electrician to just know whether the current is flowing or not and in another picture this one is needle different types of needles are here the bigger one which have handle which has handle so this needle is used by the cobbler right this needle is used by cobbler another two needles are there uh, which is used to uh, stitch the sack cloth sacks and other another small needles are there it is used to stitch the cloths i hope you got the idea this one is the hammer first picture is hammer second was the spinning wheel hammer is used by carpenters right and spinning wheel spinning wheel is used by weavers those who weave cloth those who weave cloth they use spinning wheel looms etc next is this is the blackboard blackboard is used by teacher to teach and this is a switchboard switchboard is made by electrician right it can be used by everybody but it is made by electrician i hope you have learned all those things and got the idea let me oh this is the bonus question we have reached so who uses the stethoscope right or who does use the stetho stethoscope this is also correct so options will be given in the form set uh, school ya link will be posted there you can get the option there and choose the correct option next is what kind of work would those who don't have a proper education from colleges or training to do what kind of work would those people do those who don't have a proper education from college or any training they have not attended let me tell you uh, the such people like potters carpenter tailors cobblers mostly these people don't have proper education from college so they learn their skills to do this work from another person either in their family members or outside the family member right but they don't go to college and get admission and learn their skill and pass the exam they don't do all these things they just learn their skills from any other person from their family member or from outside the family member right next is oh the this lesson plan is almost over now you have to do this particular job work read the topic tools and training of block 7 and complete s2 of block 7 from your workbook volume 1 and you have to do the practice question 4 6 in your notebook right okay this is your workbook you have to do that
so you have to do this in first so you have to identify the picture right and write the name and in second you have to list five types of job for the people trained in these two ways right and next is next is a third question is do watchmen and washerman uh, need any special training give reason for your answer right so you have to do on your own do they need any special training or they learn something from someone else you have to find out and write okay next is oh time is over so almost our video is completed thank you very much god bless you okay we'll meet in the next video